In this lesson, we're going to look at how to graph horizontal lines and vertical lines. Now, horizontal and vertical line equations look different from the regular slope-intercept form that we're used to because they only have one variable each. When you have a horizontal line, it runs this way, so all of the points on the line will have the same y value, and therefore the equation looks like y equals some number. So I've written y equals a, and a can be any number. For vertical lines, they run up and down, so they all have the same x value. All the points have the same x value, and the equation just looks like x equals some number. So let's graph one together. We will, we will graph y equals 5. And so what I want to do is plot two points that have a y value of 5. The y-intercept is an easy one, so I can find a place on the y-axis where the y value is 5, put a dot there. And now I can find any other point where the y value is 5 and draw my line. And let's graph x equals negative 3. So I just need to plot two points that have an x value of negative 3. So here's one. On the x-axis, I count out to negative 3, put my dot, and then find some other point where the x value is negative 3 and draw a line through them. Alright, one more. Let's graph f of x equals negative 2. Now we know that f of x takes the place of y, so this really says y equals negative 2. I need to find a point that has a y value of negative 2. That would be right here. So here is my point at my dot at negative 2. And then any other point that has a y value of negative 2. And then I can connect the dots. 